I think I like shadows. I can get them from umbrellas, trees, houses or rocks. But there are some special days when I have even been in the shadow of the moon. Does it sound like a fantasy or some exciting thing to you? Well, that is possible on days when there is a solar eclipse. What happens is my favorite round bodies in the sky, the sun and the moon. On those special days of eclipses, they align together. They are in the same general direction in the sky. And therefore, what happens is that the moon comes in between the sun. And therefore, we happen to be in the shadow of the moon. That is all there is to a solar eclipse. On the solar eclipse day, when the moon and the sun are in the same general direction, we also have a new moon. And there are also times when the moon is on the other side of the earth compared to the sun and it kind of gets covered by the earth's shadow. And on those days, we have a lunar eclipse. So eclipses are exciting shadow plays in the sky and they happen due to the alignment by chance of the earth's sun and the moon. These are all dependent on the orbits of these bodies in the sky and are well known by astronomers. We can even calculate what dates and what time eclipses will happen. There are also different types of solar eclipses. You must have heard of partial eclipse, annular eclipse and the total eclipse. A total eclipse happens when the moon is able to completely cover the sun. So, to see a total eclipse, you need to be on a place on the earth where you are in the shadow of the moon. Well, the earth is very broad, the moon is quite small and the sun is far away. So, there may be times when you are not actually in the best shadow of the moon, but you are slightly away from it. And there you might see a partial eclipse. So, try this activity. Put your hand out and cover one eye. Try to cover something in the far off distance with your hand. <coughs> now, open this eye and cover the other eye. You'll probably see that your hand seems to be shifted and you will be able to see part of the object which you were covering when your, this eye was closed. Okay. Now, this is exactly what happens with the uh, different types of solar eclipses. So, if you are there at a place where the moon is totally able to cover the sun, you are seeing a total eclipse and away from it, you are seeing a, only a part of the sun getting covered and that is called a partial eclipse. So, we are very soon going to experience a partial eclipse in India. Are you ready to see it? We'll keep you updated.